Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Tawny, and in today's video, I wanted to share with you guys an Everlane haul. If you're interested in seeing some of their more recent pieces, then just keep watching. So the first piece is the item that I'm wearing right now, and this is called the Flowy Jumpsuit. I got it in black, and I got it in the extra, extra small. This jumpsuit is a very, very oversized wide leg pant that basically you just pull up over your top, and it's kind of a whole one piece thing. It's meant to be super, super flowy, and I can definitely attest to that. Like I mentioned in my previous Zara haul, I've been really loving more summery worn pieces that are in the color black because I feel like that leads to a really nice transition into the fall time. So I think that this is a perfect piece for that. I will say definitely size down in this piece because it is super oversized, as you can tell from the cutaway. And this piece is super comfortable. I can definitely see it being a swimsuit cover up or just an easy throw on out Outfit that you wear around the house to run errands, super comfortable, oversized, flowy, and a very unique design as well. The next item that I have is a dress, and it's one that they actually have had for quite a while. It is their classic t-shirt dress. This is in a really nice artichoke color. I love any type of green, muted green kind of color. I think it's super flattering on a lot of skin types, and this I got in a size small. I will say it's a little bit on the looser side, so I probably could have sized down to a size extra small, but super comfortable. Again, this is just one of those really comfortable, easy pieces for a day to day around the house, loungewear, running errands, that kind of stuff. Doesn't have the most shape to it, but you could definitely add a belt if you wanted to give it a little bit more shape, or like I said, size down a little bit so that it hugs your figure a little bit more. So the next two pieces that I picked up are a very trendy piece at the moment, and they are the terry cloth set. So it comes with a pair of shorts as well as a button down top. I got this in the really light blush pink color. I think it's called Orchid, but I will have it linked down below. Anyhow, I got both of these pieces in a size small, and I do think that these are my correct sizes. The shorts were really snug around my waist area. I don't have the smallest waist, but they fit really nicely elsewhere. Still very comfortable, and I feel like these are such a comfortable cover-up if you are at the beach or on a boat and you just want to get cozy after being in a wet bathing suit for a little bit. I love that they are a matching set. I don't really think that they're the most flattering look in total and I kind of wish they had some of the green color available. I don't know that this really flatters my skin tone so much but it is a really comfortable cute set. Feels really well made and substantial. This fabric is a nice thick terry cloth material which I really like. So if you are interested in this trend which I know has been super popular lately then I do think that Everlane is a really good option. Okay next up I wanted to give some of Everlane's denim shorts a shot. I don't think I've ever actually tried their denim shorts. So I went with the way high denim short. I believe that this is a relatively new style. The whole way high line is a super, super high rise. And I can definitely attest to that. This is a very high rise. I will say that this is pretty snug for a denim short. It has a little bit of stretch to it, but it is quite tight. I got this in a size 26, which I do think is my true size. I do fluctuate anywhere from a 25 to a 27, but this one I will say is on the more snug side. So if you want a little bit of a looser, more comfortable fit, I do recommend sizing up. And I got this in the washed blue color. As you can see, it's just a very classic medium wash denim short. There's not a ton of distressing on it other than the raw hem at the bottom. There's not much more to say about them. They're kind of plain. I don't think I'm going to end up keeping them because I do have a bunch of Levi's denim shorts that I like a little bit more than this. I just feel that they're a little bit more comfortable. But if you're into a super, super high rise short, then this is a decent option to check out. On the other hand, I decided to take a look at the 90s relaxed shorts that they have. This is in the vintage sun bleached blue color, I think. Some something along those lines. It's a pretty nice medium to light, slightly faded denim color. Similar to the first pair, there's not a ton of distressing, but they do have the raw edge hem at the bottom. This one is a button fly closure as opposed to the way high shorts, which is a zip fly with a button on top. And these ones I also got in a size 26. And I will say that these ones were quite big on me actually. There was a ton of room in the waist area, especially in the back of the waist. There was a ton of gaping room there. 
And overall, I have to be honest, I don't think that these were the most flattering shorts. I think there was a little too much room in the crotch area that doesn't really make it super cute. But I will say if you want a super relaxed style, then this is a decent option, just not my favorite. Okay, the next item that I purchased is a little bit more of a transitional piece and it is one of their classic t-shirts. This is the box cut organic cotton t-shirt has a little pocket at the front here and overall it's a very standard white t-shirt long sleeve version of it i like it it's comfortable i got this mainly for the cooler days around the house when i just want to wear a comfy pair of sweatpants and a long sleeve shirt this is pretty standard i got it in a size small you'll see from the cutaways it fit me pretty well and i think that this is a basic that you can't really go wrong with okay next up is definitely a more summery piece and it's the tube top that i'm wearing right now i quickly decided to pop it on this is in the color sienna which i think is such a beautiful color for the summertime, I've been really loving burnt oranges, corals, reds, really bright like reddish orange colors for the summertime and I think this one's a really nice take on that. There's not much to say about this. It's a cotton tube top, really comfortable. I got this in a size small and it is very snug on me but not in a too uncomfortable way. I feel very secure in it like it's not gonna fall down. It also has a nice little cami bra underneath it so you have a little bit of support. However, if you do have a little bit of a larger chest, I do recommend sizing up at least one size because it is quite tight and might be a little bit difficult to get on and off but otherwise I think it's a nice length it's a little bit shorter not super long but I think it works really nicely for tucking into high-waisted shorts and lastly I have this white ribbed cutaway tank as they call it it's like a really high neck racer back tank and I think that the quality is really nice of this it's a lot more of a thick fabric than I was expecting definitely really substantial I don't know if I love the way it looks on me personally but if you do like this high neck halter kind of style I do think that this is a really great option it feels super super high quality and it's also not too long that you have to fold it under itself in order to fit nicely under jeans but it's also not too short where you can't tuck it into a pair of high-waisted jeans this is another one of those modern takes on a very basic top and I don't think you can go wrong with just wearing it as is or even under another shirt as the weather starts to get a little bit cooler but that is all that I have for you guys in this haul. I hope that you enjoyed seeing these pieces. You know I love doing Everlane hauls. I will continue to do Everlane hauls. I am excited to get into the more transitional and fall weather. So definitely be sure to subscribe down below if you're interested in seeing more fall fashion coming up. And don't forget to give this video a like if you did enjoy it. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.